Hi everyone, welcome to today's Ice House webinar. I am Bryce Stewart, the Community Manager, and today we have Raywin with us, a very familiar face to many, um, so really great to have her on the webinar today as we unpack and talk more a little bit about our Owner Manager Exchange Program, which is known as OMEX. So thanks Raywin for your time. Oh, thanks, Brian. Um, just to introduce myself, as um, Brian's just done, um, introduced yourself. Yep. I'm Raywin Goodwin, and I'm the customer relationship partner with the Ice House, and I look after what we class as our journey programs, residential programs, essentially. Mm -hmm. Absolutely, and it's so cool when I chat to people and they're like, oh, how's Raywin doing? Because most people, if not all, correct me if I'm wrong, have met you along the on their owner manager program experience. Yes, Is that right? Um, I have met every single owner that has come on the program, which um, wow. as I keep saying, I'm getting a lot older and they're getting a lot younger. So <laughs> but it's still fabulous to be involved. That's so cool, Raywin. Like honestly, that's that is awesome. Um, cool. First question about OMX is who is owner manager exchange for? Uh, the Owner Manager Exchange Program is for alumni of Owner Manager Program or Agri Business Program. Mm. Agri is a program we ran um, many years ago, but we still have a great pool of alumni, um, and some of them come back and do the Owner Manager Exchange Program. Mm, cool. Yeah, that's really a great answer. And how long does the program go for, and whereabouts um, is it held? Right, okay. Um, the program is essentially two and a half days and it kind of resembles very much a block of an owner manager program where we start at 10 a.m. and we have introductions and um, very much the format's the same, the horseshoe that you're familiar with um, and it's led by two facilitators which are Deb Shepard and Dale Kolb. Mm. Awesome. And whereabouts um, in it's the country? In beautiful Queenstown. Great oh, destination. Good. And for the upcoming program, we've got one um, 24 to 26 November, and that's going to be at the Kamana Lake House in um, Queenstown, a stunning location. Mm, so, so stunning. Eh? Like, yeah, yeah, such a cool place to host something like this. So exciting um, and yeah maybe a bit of a bigger question um, if someone's sort of listening to this or watching this and going okay well but what can I expect what can they expect from OMX um, what they can expect is it's kind of a, a chance to come back um, and get a shot in the arm is what some people talk about <laughs> um, to extend your network because on the program there will be people that are from different cohorts yeah. so you're broadening the network uh, what they can expect is um, it's a little bit like they, our alumni will remember the business plan discussions that they had as part of the program. It's a bit like that. We'll cover a bit of content and then we'll break into groups. We have some amazing mentors that will lead that discussion. Mm -hmm. So we do ask that participants um, give some thought to some pre-work and we give them some prescriptive um, questions to think about before they come on the program, sort of things about burning issues, um, what keeps you awake, awake at night, and then you'll break into groups. And, you know, getting feedback from your peers is just as important from the mentors. Mm -hmm. So, you know, typically like an owner-manager program, there's the content, but there's a the social element. So a lot of fun, a lot of connecting with other people and just getting together. And, you know, as we often hear, people feel quite alone. And there it is, you get back again and have that whole um, connection from alumni which is amazing mm. yeah I think if I as I've learned more about the program it's definitely a great way for people to engage in ongoing community at the ice house definitely um, yeah and I think a lot of people you know do their owner manager program experience and have a really great time with that cohort uh, this is a really easy way to like you said get that shot in the arm um, mm. meet new people and actively choose to be part of the community um, after the, your program. You know, it's easy to sort of not drop off, but easy to go, cool, that was awesome moment in time mm. experience, but this is a good way to continue engaging with the Ice House for sure. And one of the things is we run two owner manager exchange programs a year. Mm. One, um, we originally started with one and that's in June each year and that's got a lot of traction. Lots of people that come back year after year. Some have been back four times. Wow. So that means that um, the program is refreshed with new content. And, of course, over 
the last few years, we've had to content, um, focus on, you know, issues for COVID, you know, how are you navigating through that? So we're being all relevant and current. So the program is updated. The one in November is more for people who um, haven't come back um, repeatedly. Um, as I mentioned, the one in June um, of the 22, we had 15 people had already done one, two or three programs. Wow. So it's great to see the re returning people. Totally. So we look forward to um, seeing, hopefully, some more joining uh, joining us in November and uh, getting another shot of ice out. Yeah, totally. Well, I'll make sure that in the copy we put, you know, where people can find out some more information and who they can get in touch with. But thanks yeah. so much, Raywin, for sort of unpacking what people can expect and who's it for. I think it's one of those programs that's like, oh, you know, what, what's that? And it's just such a brilliant opportunity to, mm. to like we said, keep engaging with the Ice House and, and get sort of refreshed um, insight and, and inspiration. So, yeah, awesome. Appreciate your time. And um, just to, in closing, I'm really happy to, if anyone wants to touch base with me and have a chat about the program, I can put them in touch with people who have done the course to have a chat too. So, yeah, yeah, happy to help in any way I can and look forward to hoping seeing some more of our wonderful alumni in uh, Queenstown in November. Awesome. Bring it on, for sure. That's a really good point that they can chat to you about it as well, someone that's been on many of the programs. Um, so the right person for that. Cool. Well, thanks so much for your time, Raywin, and hope uh, those tuning in have uh, got something out of today's webinar. Okay. Thanks, Brian.